Uh, this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson. We have Preston down here with us all the way from New York City. Now, Preston grew up here in Houston, but he moved up to New York because he's in the arts and moved to Manhattan, not Manhattan, but Brooklyn, you said, Manhattan right? Manhattan first. Then. Manhattan and Brooklyn. <laughs> and uh, he has developed, since he's been up in New York now, mind you, a lot of anxiety and uh, stress and asthma has increased as a result of him direct result you told me of living in New York City yeah. that would cause me to have breathing problems and, <laughs> and anxiety as well mm -hmm. but you know we have a lot of patients here that come from New York City and we've got a doctor up in New York City Dr. Stephen, Stephen Shoshansi who I'm going to refer Preston up to for follow-up care when he goes back up there he's in Manhattan off of Broadway he's a team ring dinger doc he learned all this down here but he came down here to get adjusted today in hopes that we can help his nervous system to function at a better, higher level and not have as much anxiety. And even though we do not treat asthma or allergies or any other medical conditions, if we find subluxations in areas of the spine that can influence his autonomic nervous system and improve his function, that's going to help him be a healthier human being and hopefully calm his nervous system down and sympathetic. Sympathetic nervous system is directly related to the uh, fight or flight syndrome, which is the anxiety and you get a lot of like panic attack type feeling, your heart beating yep. fast and difficulty breathing, things like that. Yep. That's called fight or flight. In fact, that's probably what I'm gonna name your video today. Fight New, or York, New York City man <laughs> comes in with fight or flight, imagine that. All right, so we've already done Preston's history and examination and was that thorough by the way? Yes. Because you told me you'd been to another chiropractor a few months ago. Yes. And didn't really get any good results with yes. that yet, you told me. I'm not going to mention the name of it, but you've heard me say it over and over again. One of my favorite places because we see all their patients all the time. Okay, so let's show them what you got, Preston. I'm going to have you close your eyes. No, I'm going to do this posture for him again. Let's have you close your eyes and flex your head forward and backwards. You just have to hold these hands out in front. We see that with people a lot. That pulls your shoulders and your heads forward. And he's got forward head translation on the z-axis, right translation on the x-axis, and I asked him if he was a side sleeper, and he said yes. Pelvis has translated left of center. He has less room over here on this left side than he does on the right side. Okay, we're gonna lay you back on your stomach on this one, Preston. Now, since this is his first adjustment here at Advanced Chiropractic Relief, I'm gonna do the biophysics table first so that I can get a feel for his joint range of motion and his muscular ligaments, tonicity. His left leg short by a half an inch in this prone position. I bring his legs up, it gets longer by a quarter of an inch, and that tightens up in his lumbar spine. That's the positive knockless on the leg length Deerfield check. And he had a positive sacral deviation on this left side here in this pelvis. Palpatory exam reveals he's got paraspinal muscle hypertonicity, particularly on this right side, but uh, rotation of his lumbar vertebra to where the, the uh, transverse process and the the facets, which are called zygopopsial joints in the lumbar spine, are rotated this way too. That's why it's sticking out more on this right side. I don't know if you can see that or not from there. Does the right side look puffier than the left side? A little bit. Yep. But that goes all the way up into his thoracic spine. Now, the sympathetic nervous system comes out between T1 and L2, and that's connected through a sympathetic chain that runs up and down the thoracic spine its entire length. So when you get any kind of subluxation complex in the thoracic spine, it can cause a sympathetic response within reflexes up and down the spine on both sides and can influence uh, the spinal nerves that go out and supply the various organs, muscles, tissues, and cells, which is really what chiropractic is all about is enhancing the function of the nervous system through chiropractic adjustments of the vertebral subluxation complex. So I'm gonna start off on his pelvis. I'm gonna adjust his left SI first. Some of these will be a little sore at first, Preston, just because they've been out for a while. You'll feel better when I get them back in place, though. So. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. There we go. Uh -uh. Let me get in there on this one. There. You're hanging on to that one, aren't you, Preston? Watch too many videos. That's I know right. it's coming. You know I'm going to get it, though, right? <laughs> now your legs are even. This should already feel a little easier. Uh -huh. Didn't tighten up as bad? Good. 
Okay, you're gonna feel your head popping up on this next one. There we go. Okay, let's turn you on your back, please, sir. Okay. Yep. Get it slide down this way just a little bit. No, that's too far. There you go. Now put both arms straight out sideways, palms facing up. So I'm adjusting his shoulders, the AC joints, his sternoclavicular joint, and his anterior costal sternal joints with these adjustments. There you go. You can relax your hands right here. Let this leg go in my hands here like a limp rag. There we go. <laughs> you should have felt that from your knee all the way to your lower back. Yeah. Okay, good. Same thing here. There we go. You feel that one too? Yeah. Okay, let's sit you up, face towards your mom. There we go. So what's your girlfriend's name? Grace. Grace, he should come back to New York a little calmer, cooler, and collected <laughs> from his adjustments this week. There we go. Okay. Now, Press has never had the manual spinal decompression adjustment on the y-axis done before, so he's going to get his first ring dinger today, right? A ring dinger, baby, all yep. the way. <laughs> yeah. Okay, relax. There we go. Okay, let's come over here on this table next. No, you're fine. You got a front row seat right here. <laughs> All right, I'm going to have you on your back on this table, Preston, but right there, head up this way. You're going to let your legs just relax. Have you started sleeping like this yet? <laughs> I knew that was coming at some point. <laughs> See, your legs are parallel with the floor right now. That should feel pretty relaxed in that position, actually. He's got a cervical curve forward without the pillow under here. See, when you got a pillow under your head, it rotates and it flexes the spine forward, which reduces the cervical lordosis. So that's, that's actually an adverse event for the spine as well. Okay, I'm going to pin your pelvis in down here. Slide down back. There you go. Perfect. Whataburger last night. <laughs> burgers. that's Texas is known for water burgers. Nice deep breath in. Exhale. Mm-hmm. Oh, there you go. <laughs> you should have felt that go all the oh, way yeah. down your spine. Yes, sir. You okay there, Preston? Yeah, I didn't even have to You're still kicking, toe. you're okay. <laughs> okay, let me have you here. Yes, sir. Just like that, crackhead's gonna love you too. Even if you are from New York City. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of crack addicts. Yeah, there are a lot of crack addicts up in New York City, actually. You might have to beat down here though. Let me help you up here. There we go, sideways. Yeah, so always want to get up sideways like that. Let's stand here in front of the mirror now. You're back in Houston, so I'm gonna shoot you. We're used to that up in New York too though, right? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Your homework your head's forward and right so we're gonna pull these guys here put these here you might want to spread your feet a little further apart so I don't knock you over and we're gonna bring that head straight back you're right so we're gonna go left and look back at the wall behind you yep you'll feel a little tap on the atlas there excuse me I didn't mean to hit you in the head and right there now relax and when you go forward and backwards again Preston this should feel a little bit smoother in your neck and upper back but you tell me you feel like it's gliding a little oh, easier. Yeah. Yeah, back to neutral. Okay, take a look in the mirror at neutral now. So you're more centered now. You're not too far to the right anymore. Still down a little bit, but not bad. The pelvis is lined up there. You got more room down here now. Awesome. So, what would you share with our crackheads worldwide about your very first experience here at Advanced Chiropractic Relief? Well, I've been a crack addict for over a year and uh, I've been looking forward to this. I, I was watching earlier videos and found out he uh, got into chiropractic partially because of asthma and that's 
I've had my entire life, and um, no, that's the whole reason I got into chiropractic because it cured my asthma. And and you know, I've struggled with it my entire life, and it just got really bad over the past year. And anxiety just all kind of feeds into one thing, and I, I want to try everything natural before I go into you know getting any prescription meds. So. And I want you all to get all freaked out because I said it cured my asthma because it's the only thing that ever helped my asthma whenever I had asthma back in grade school. I got adjusted in the eighth grade when years and years of medical care had failed to get any results on me at all with inhalers and shots and allergy shots twice a week for two years and pills and potions. It's none of that worked. And when I started getting adjusted, Shoot, it didn't even take a month before I started feeling normal and not having to take all the inhalers and the medication. So, I'm like Trump. I say that my asthma was cured, just like his COVID was cured, and it was for me, and it was for him. Cured is a strong word. We don't treat medical conditions, but it helps your body function at a higher level of efficiency, and that's really what chiropractic's all about. Don't cross your arms like that. You'll pull your shoulders forward, and you'll get all anxious. I do it because I'm anxious. Yeah. So this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson, coming to you from Advanced Chiropractic Relief from Preston, from New York City. We'll see y'all soon.